bunch of people. And uh, so this restaurant is feeding 20 different families, you know, I mean, for 31 years. And uh, so I, I believe I gotta take care of it. Now, I had seen this location uh, before I liked it, and uh, every time I came, somebody had already rented it. Finally, one time I didn't see anybody in there, and uh, I looked for the landlord, I found the landlord, because there was no sign on it. Um, I called him up, I said, hey, I'm interested. Uh, then, uh, the next thing was, oh, how am I gonna get the money? I decided to work three jobs, from 6.30 in the morning until 9 in the evening and weekends. And I cut down on all the unnecessary um, consumption, like beer, wine, you know, soda, etc., and saved every penny. And uh, that's how it started. Yeah. It was only this side, not the other side. Uh, I had about a thousand square foot. And, uh, refrigeration here and a few tables and, uh, that they were not up to my taste so I redid the whole thing. Part of the hardship was you know like um, we're sitting here waiting for customers at the beginning uh, nobody would come in not even one person all day long. Uh, we tried not to let that bother us we, I kept telling the employees we have good food good service they will come we have good food, good service, they will come, just repeatedly. And that's what happened. It was people who came in, and they came the following week, you know, and you know, just gradually uh, from, you know, uh, average $120 per day in sales, we went up, you know, you know uh, tremendously here. Yeah. We love what we're doing, and employees are happy. And we try to make every customer happy walking out the door. I really believe once you put your love in your work, you know, it makes a big difference. Well, uh, we uh, put out uh, good quality, good service, and when uh, people come in, uh, we try to take care of them and appreciate their support, and they continue that. You know, we have great customers. They're, you know. We become friends with, with our customers. I've experienced that when you give, uh, you get a lot of pleasure out of it. Uh, the first day when they announced the restaurants are going to be closed and open for you know, to-go orders, I told all the employees, you know, your job is safe, you know, and I told the uh, entertainment uh, uh, people. If you don't mind to sing for nobody, come on in. You know, that's what we got to do to get back to uh, normal. Uh, like, I, I took a big pan of food uh, for the club that, you know, I, I work out. I gave it to them. I said, you guys enjoy it. I mean, you wouldn't believe how many texts I got uh, thanking me. And uh, whoever saw me, oh, thanks for the food. And it, it, it's a good feeling. I like to share. Uh, my experience with others. Yeah. Like uh, so if somebody asks for a recipe, uh, I give it to them. I uh, tell them all about my experience and I uh, tell them some um, words of encouragement. I said, keep practicing. You know, I, I said, we've been practicing for years. So you practice a few times, you'll get the hang of it. Life is all about giving and receiving, giving is uh, better than receiving. And every year we do something uh, different. We add something, we spend money on it. Yeah. Uh, a couple of years ago we spent, you know, $100,000 on it. And a few years back, you know, we did another $100,000. Uh, and it all comes back, you know, uh, because you respect uh, the uh, the source that uh, earning you money. Uh, and uh, this is 31 years later. And um, it's been a good, good ride, yeah. Prima Pasta is our signature dish here. 
uh, I came up with this idea to mix all these vegetables, you know, a lot of garlic and basil that pesto sauce had. I'm not a big fan of pesto sauce myself. And it turned out real good and everybody loved it. It's number one seller here. Uh, we usually make the uh, prima pasta with angel hair pasta. And sometimes, you know, people ask for bow tie, penne, regular spaghetti, however, fettuccine, linguine, um, garlic, basil, tomatoes, sun-dried tomatoes. We add salt and pepper and parmesan cheese and pine nuts, and you can taste the freshness uh, in the food.